Aaron Bailey has surrounded himself with racist, misogynistic, homophobic, xenophobic people and organizations, including chasing after the chief among them, Donald Trump. That's all you can Who talk do you trust about. to stand up for you? He's going to stand up for them, not for the working families and particularly black and brown people across the state of Illinois. It means that every life matters. And unfortunately, J.B. Pritzker, during his four years in office, has created so much division and hate in this state with, with racial ideas and ideology. It has to end. Governor Pritzker is perfectly fine with our children getting abortions without their parents knowing anything about it. I think that's extreme. Governor Pritzker is perfectly fine injecting his gender curriculum, the first of its kind in the nation, into our schools. Woke ideology. I think that's extreme. Governor Pritzker's Family Foundation is the primary sponsor for experimental gender surgeries that, in children's false. hospitals that's all ridiculous. across this nation, right here in Chicago. False. I think that's extreme. Well, he wants to jail doctors and jail oh, women gosh. who are seeking to exercise their reproductive rights. I, I have stood my whole life for women exercising their rights, especially their reproductive rights. We've got to make sure that Illinois is a haven for women all across our state so that they can exercise those rights and make sure that their doctors are not uh, imprisoned either in <clears throat> Illinois or anywhere else in the nation. Look, I think doctors, parents, and those kids uh, are working together to determine what's best for them. I think uh, our hospitals, especially Lurie, which is one of the great children's hospitals in the entire nation, are very responsible about these things. But look, I stand up for the rights of our LGBTQ community to make decisions for themselves. You signed, you believe that children you of any age can make whatever right decision with, for their health that they want to make. I believe parents have the best interest in mind for their children and parents should be making that decision, not doctors or teachers or governors.